Hi, hello, how are you? And welcome to the fourth episode of In Search of the Ultimate Bullet. In today's video, we'll check out Leven's Milk Plus. Enjoy! Hi Leven, how are you? Uh, I'm fine, thank you. Okay, can you introduce yourself to us? Um, I'm uh, Leven. I live in the city of Antwerp for more than 20 years. Um, and I own uh, a, a bullet for more than 10 years, I think. So, um, apart from being a bulleteer, you're also a bike activist. And uh, if I'm not wrong, you also have a kind of a, a bicycle uh, block yeah. in or about Antwerp and cycling? Yeah, together with uh, Stan Wins, um, we own uh, Antwerp and Ice. Uh, what we want to do is um, to um, support uh, daily bikers uh, in the city of, uh, of Antwerp and felicitate them with their uh, good choice. Okay. How and when did you learn about the existence of uh, bullet bicycles? More than 20 years ago, uh, I saw a picture of uh, Michael Colville Anderson um, with his bullet. Uh, the picture was made by um, Diego France, a Belgian photographer and, uh, and a friend of mine. Um, that was 10 years ago and I, when I saw that picture I thought that's what I need and I ordered one. Okay. So, and is, uh, is this your first bullet bike? Um, no, this Milk Plus is uh, my second bike. Um, my first one was a uh, Bluebird 71. Um, one of the first uh, generation and this one is one of the third generation. Okay. What's the difference between the different uh, generations of uh, yeah. frames? The difference between uh, the, my first uh, bike and this one, um, the one of the first generation was, uh, was not with a belt, of course. It didn't exist uh, then. Um, other things were pretty much uh, the same. It had also an Alfine uh, 8. Um, but the... <laughs> The greatest difference is the lack was herbal. Um, okay. It, it peeled off all the time. Okay. This one is okay. Is okay. Okay. So, Liva, um, is this bullet your, your daily ride? Uh, yes. I, I own uh, several bikes, uh, but this one is, uh, is the one I use every day. Uh, I also don't own, own a car, um, so it's, it's my uh, daily transport. Okay. Do you use this bike uh, to, to go on vacations also, or for longer trips? Um, yeah, I did several uh, vac vacations with, uh, with the Bullet, um, with friends, but also with, uh, with my family. Um, yeah, it's, it's very hand handsome and um, uh, great, because you always have a table and a seat uh, with you. Okay. What is the largest or heaviest uh, freight you ever moved with your bike? Okay, uh, so some years ago we did, uh, we did a whole movement only with bullets. Uh, so I carried a mattress, uh, a big closet and, and, and other uh, several things. Um, you can find that movie also on YouTube. Okay, we'll, we'll check that out. <laughs> so Liva, can you uh, show us uh, what kind of parts you uh, put on your bike to personalize it and uh, give us some explanation about the parts and, and why that you choose for those uh, parts? Uh, my bullet is uh, just a bit uh, customized. Mm -hmm. um, I, uh, have, I use a belt with uh, the Alphine A8. Uh -huh. I'm a big fan of the uh, always on light uh, from Supernova, and it's mounted on a uh, customized plate from Brompton. Uh -huh. And then in the front you have also uh, uh, Supernova? Yeah. I like it, but uh, it's, it's uh, also um, an always on. Uh -huh. you, can't, uh, you can put it, put it out. Also oh, very handful is the saddle high adjustment um, from, uh, from XLC, so my wife can also use uh, the bike. My pedals are um, SPD on one side and normal on the other side. Uh -huh. 
Uh, this one are uh, from uh, Luke. Okay. Of course, many uh, bulleteers use the uh, the quad lock uh, holder for uh, holding your phone. Uh -huh. Uh, and I mounted uh, a GPS from Lesine, the XL version. Uh, here in the front I use a uh, bag from Farer, but uh, I fixed it. Um, so it's always, all the time, it's all the time on my bike, but uh, you can, can uh, flatten it to mm -hmm. put larger cargo on it. Okay. To fix things, I use this uh, handful hook with a normal rope, uh -huh. um, I think it's better than, uh, than straps. Um, yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's a, a very hand, uh, a very useful uh, hook, so you can fix things easily. Okay. So, Liva, when money was no object, how would your ultimate bullet uh, would look like? What, how would it be built up? Uh, honestly, I think it would be uh, almost like this one. Uh, maybe I should buy, buy a second one uh, because uh, life is too short to ride shit bikes. <laughs> okay.